Hi, right, too. Dre here. I want to tell you guys a story about Comcast. And I think I've told this story before, but what the hell. All right, it all started like this. I had um, basic cable, and I had internet service. And I don't know what my price started out at, but my price was like $145. Okay, this was some years ago. Um... I heard Clark Howard talking about, you know, you should call Comcast and ask them to lower your price. So I did that, and they swore up and down they couldn't lower the price. So I told them to come get the stuff, and they told me to return it. So I returned it, and they gave me a piece of paper saying that I had returned my stuff, and I went home. Okay, so for about, I don't know, maybe two weeks, or it might have been a month, they called me and they told me that they would lower the price down to like seventy something dollars a month for six months. And if I come back to them. So I said, okay. And they told me to go pick up my equipment. So I went to the Comcast place, picked up my new equipment, bought it home, plugged everything up, and it actually worked. And I was like, wow, that was, you know, that was turned on kind of easy. Well, how about I get a bill? And the bill was like, I think the bill was like 300 and some dollars. Well, what happened was they hadn't turned off my service even though I turned in my, my equipment. They hadn't turned the service off. So with the new service, I mean the new service and the old service still on, it was 300 and some dollars. So I then tried, I called in, tried to talk to somebody about that, and they kept giving me the runaround. They told me it was going to be taken care of. Uh, about the stuff not being turned off, but then they act stupid when they asked. They asked me, um, uh, who was the guy that told me it was gonna give me seventy five dollars? I mean, the bill was gonna be seventy five dollars. They claim they don't have no kind of offer like that, and they don't know nothing about that offer. So basically, the bill was one hundred forty five dollars again after I paid it three hundred some dollars. So of course, I told them, you know, forget it, turn it off. So I took the equipment back to them again and forgot about it got another receipt as a matter of fact and then i get another bill this time the bill was like six hundred dollars i'm serious six hundred something dollars so at that point i realized that talking to comcast was wasting my time so someone told me to talk to the better business bureau so i um I think I used my, what they call it, uh, hotspot, and I did a, t I emailed, uh, well, I set up a, what do you call it, a claim at the Better Business Bureau, and I sat down, and I tried, I explained it pretty much the way I just explained it, but I broke it down, I, I tried not to make the the uh, letter too long, but I wanted to put 100% honest detail. Well, about maybe two weeks later, I got a, I think it was two weeks later, I got a phone call from the Better Business Bureau and they asked me had Comcast called me and I told them no, they had not called me. <clears throat> well anyway, the lady told me the Comcast was going to be calling me shortly and I think a day or two later Comcast called me and it was a different woman <coughs> and she talked to me and told me, you know, she exp I explained everything was going on, and she told me she understood what was going on, and she ended up giving me, writing me a check for forty two dollars. Can you believe that? I don't really think they owed me any money. I thought it was it was broke even. <clears throat> anyway, I then she told me if I wanted to get service back, to call her directly, <clears throat> and she was take care of. And she did. She gave me six months of just internet for $29. It then went up to like $49 after six months. And then after that six months, it went up to $59. And it pretty much, it done ease up to $65 now. But that's been, that's been like four or five years. But uh, anyway, it was just a trip how much bull crap I went through with Comcast. But it's funny how when you call the Better's Business Bureau, they stepped in line. Funny how that worked.
Dre, y'all have a good day.